Ring-a-ling-ling. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Oh, so cold. Discount prices make me think about the times I was young and I had to feel like Santa didn't care about me. Like the elves at the North Pole could all but fare without me. Like they knew I existed. Passed by my house but somehow missed it. So I could no longer believe because my eyes wouldn't allow me to. <laughs> Yo, if I could confess, when I was young I didn't think Santa knew my address. That's why as I'm in the mall witnessing the childhood pilgrimage to Santa's lap, I can't help but to think that America is addicted to some sort of holiday crack. Rushing around, buying it up, hoping to get this particular this or that particular that. A knowledgeable that our pursuit is counted on by our dearest companies to go from the red to the black. In fact, let's go back, way, way, way back, December 25th, 1995 to be exact. See, a couple of weeks before that, my fams and I was kicked out on the street. We had no money, no car, no place, no phone. A cold pizza in the box was all we had to eat. So, when Christmas rolled around and we didn't land on our feet yet, I got all that I could expect. Nothing. I got the tears from my eyes as my knees hit a Michigan floor. I got the painful, hurtful look in my mom's eyes as she saw her nine-year-old son's cries hit her to the core. So in my heart, Christmas always maintained a constant tour. But that's Christmas, right? No, 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 no. It's got to be so much deeper than that. What about that teenage chick who got knocked up before she was married? Walking around nine months claiming it was God's baby she was carrying. What about that dude who was with that girl claiming, I ain't that baby's daddy. But little did he know that that baby was his dad, see. He didn't know what to do when them labor pains hit. In that cold, dark ghetto barn there was no room left in that inn. Maybe that Christmas wasn't too bad of a route. Maybe pain and redemption is what Christmas is all about. And not the gifts from a fat white dude who sits on a couch. 